One of the Democratic candidates for governor made a campaign stop in Bay County today. Florida Commissioner of Agriculture Nikki Freed met with the Democratic Women's Club of Bay County. As News 13's Thomas Schultz tells us, Freed says everyone has the same concerns. And I'm not running to be governor of the Democratic Party. I'm running for governor of the entire state. Nikki Freed met with a couple dozen Bay County Democrats Friday morning. She says small face-to-face -face campaign stops are imperative. These types of town halls are essential um, because not only am I getting to have one-on-one -on -one conversations, getting to answer questions, uh, but also getting people excited about the, what we're doing here. Freed says her first priority is to fix the economy if she's elected governor. First objective is looking at the economy. You know, we have a housing crisis. And so I'd be day one uh, in having an executive order stating a state of emergency for housing. She says people from both parties are concerned about the same issues. Everybody is concerned about the same things. That's the economy, that's housing, that's making sure that they've got a roof over their heads, making sure that they got food on their plates. Uh, that's not a partisan issue. But Freed says that Florida has suffered from having the Republican Party in power for almost three decades. The last 28 years, we've been gutting our affordable housing trust fund. Uh, we have not put money and energy behind energy efficiency on the environment. Uh, we have an education system that is failing the future of our state. In Panama City, Thomas Schultz, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Freed says that she has learned how to work across the aisle by being the only Democrat right now on the Florida cabinet.